Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know, and it is time for some more of the long run where we are playing Luffy and the Fortress of Doom Restored. It's a ROM hack of the original game. Last time we went to see some elves who couldn't really help us, but we ended up finding a path forward. And we have our entire party now. Um, Coolio, me, uh, Agro, Lufia, and Jerry. Who joined us last time? Uh, I made absolutely no attempt to clean this up, by the way. So uh, maybe we should you know, do that. It has been a bit of a weird time, so you know. Just gonna make sure that everyone is wearing their best equipment. In general, I don't think I'm gonna throw away uh, throw away rings, really. I don't think I'm gonna get rid of the wind heels either. Andrus to brandish for various reasons. Surely one of them isn't friggin' it's cursed. Silk is better, yeah. Wrist, uh, glass beret, high heels, and green. Okay. So let's go sell off this uh, additional equipment. Which I should have done before the stream, but you know, we're here now. Uh, I'm just gonna sell everything that isn't boots or ring. Your rings aren't rings. Aren't ring. I think this is um that your pick is used to excuse me. It's used to damage enemies, uh I'll hold on to it for now. Maybe I'll hold on to this bunny suit too, I don't know. Uh, keeping the wind heels. I think that's all I'm getting rid of for now. I could probably get rid of the escapes and warps, honestly, because we have those as a spell now, both of them. So as long as we have a magic jar on hand, we don't really need these anymore. There we go, that clears up that patient out. See if there's anything that we can buy actually. Uh, look mode. And the iron helm is an upgrade. The half mail is an upgrade, but it's very heavy. Pass on that actually. And there's two weapon upgrades, and this one is stronger, but that one's very heavy. Look at that, that's an, that's an increase of 50 right there. 
I think I'm gonna give myself the trident. And Astero could have the Morning Star if not for the fact that, you know, I don't have the money for it. Just like in real life. And you can have half of it. An iron hat, that's what I got for you. Uh, and I got you. I guess you can use this long sword actually, it's still an upgrade. And you can have the half nail. I don't think any of these are upgrades for you guys. Just about good, I think. Oops. I suddenly picked quit. Time to get to Redell if you can get to the tunnel. The tunnel's too dangerous. on items. Something is wrong at the end of the tunnel. I think this game is leading us into a tunnel. I can't really shake that feeling. Also, is there anything here we can rob? I don't think so. Like, where do people live? Like, this is like the only house, and there's barely anything there. Um... I'm gonna have to deny that, Jewel, um, because I'm playing Lufia 1 right now. I don't really want to do Lufia 2 next. Like, I, I do plan on doing Lufia 2, I just don't really want to do it, like, right immediately. Hmm, I don't know. You know, I'm gonna sit on it for now. I'll think about whether I want to accept that or um, not do that right now and give you back your points, your doodads. But uh, it's not to say that I'm not going to do Lufia 2, it's just that I don't, I wasn't really planning on doing it for a little while. I have like a bunch of stuff in my queue. Also, hey, J Pop and Yamba. I mean, you, you, like, wherever Jewel is, you pretty much need a team of specialists to clean them up, to clean up after her. No matter what she is doing. Trust me on this. Okay, so maybe we're looking for a tunnel.
Uh, this must be the tunnel we're talking about. You rude. I had to talk to you and you move away. Small scratch by no no can't be the other side. Danger ahead. Danger Will Robinson. Like, I'm trying to move to certain spaces and it's not letting me do that. It's bizarre. I'm trying to find if there's like a path through, but like... just not be right now. It's probably like I have to walk like exactly the correct path or else I can't get through. There's probably a solution that we're going to need to find somewhere else. Jaren's attack. Huh? Or maybe she won't need to even attempt it. Luffy levels up. I had noticed that Agro's health was getting low, and I was like, well, I'd better heal him after this fight, but I guess friggin' nope. You're just gonna get flattened. Well, let's do like Gamba and break out the break out the booze. when there's like three groups like that. A girl splat indeed. got rid of all of our warps.
Yeah, stuff is, uh... Stuff's getting rough out here. Well, now we got two characters who know stronger. Three characters who know stronger. Even better. I don't know if I'm going the right way, by the way. I hope that's clear. Ooh, nice, Chris. I'm just glad that I'm able to book it through uh, through these uh, various wild ones. Uh, yeah, the the how long to beat is based on the uh, the original. So um, for for anyone who was not here during the pre-stream, that was. Uh, as a reminder, because I think I mentioned it before, like 26 and a half hours. Um, so yeah, we gotta take into consideration two things. One, that um, run speed is a lot faster. And two, that encounter, uh, encounter rate is a lot lower. Encounter rate was uh, was a little high for a bit. Oh, geez, 87. Yikes. Yeah, like it, the encounter rate was a little high for a bit, but that's because I forgot I had equipped the monster ring. This is a wrong hack, yes. I played the original game a very long time ago. Because I, I don't remember much about it. Yes, it is a Super Nintendo game. It was released for the Super Nintendo Chalmers. You did notice this? Ah, were you... Were you a Genesis family or uh, something else? Sega kid, gotcha. I'm learning. We got another cleaver, which uh, ain't great. For one thing, the attack power is a lot lower, and for another thing, I'm pretty sure it's cursed. Um, what's that of it? Oh, travel. Oh, this allows me to specifically go to Alfreya. So when I was worried last time about the fact that um, we couldn't warp till Freya, it turns out that uh, Jaren here was able to do this the entire time, but only Jaren because she is half elf. 
So I guess I didn't need to go overtime last week. Oh well. Have I been here? I guess not. Oh, I did not. I have given up, but I'll tell you what I know. Okay. Uh, you take a screenshot of that. It doesn't need to be that big. There we go. Put it there. Yeah, my, my cousin had a Dreamcast. It was, um... It was an interesting console, but also I feel like it was basically Microsoft tricking Sega into, like, designing their own console. You know what I mean? Oh, there's the, uh... Before anything else, let's go and uh... restore our ranks at ranks. Power Stone War. Well, wasn't Power Stone also on the on the PlayStation? All I know is like I've only ever played the demo of Power Stone. I think it was on a demo disc. Really, the, the Dreamcast should have got uh, a better deal. It was, it was kind of... It was an interesting console, but it was a little, like, faded to fail type of thing. Okay, up one. Right two. Up one. Right two. One, two, three, four. Left three. Down one. Left two, down one, left two, and I accidentally went three. It's the one downside of having fast walking. Precision is hard. Up one, right two, up one, right two, up four, one, two, three, down one, up to the rock, down one, left two. Oh man, you were so close! Hall effect stick and Hall effect triggers and Dreamcast controller are cool. You can get those at least for the Switch. I I kind of would like to get some Hall effect uh, sticks for. At least my pro controller. You have all six is the maze balls. Yeah, and those are um, a lot less prone to drifting. I don't even know, like, can they even drift? I don't know. I suppose the Magnus can, could, like, come out of alignment after a long time. Oh, they can? Oh, 
We got a free replacement, nice. Um... And these armor lords look kind of nasty. And I need to heal Aguro again. Before he gets like critted on. Aguro levels up and learns nothing because he is incapable of learning. That's right, I said it. You're dumb. Yeah, it's just like playing golf. The answer is always hit it as hard as you can. Okay, the Agro, you're doing a great job of tanking. I don't think you should be tanking quite that much. Um, honestly, I should probably have my character do most of the healing because, like, there's not a whole lot else he's doing with his uh, magic uh, other than float right now. I don't think I'm going to search all of that. Where am I now? Puts me back here. Um, Well, we're somewhere anyway. What's this battle wire? What does that do? Is that a weapon? A weapon? Yeah, sure enough. Um, let's give Luffy a whip, I guess. Also, I don't like the fact that I've gotten two stone cures out of this uh, cave. Miracle and Folded Silk, which I think might be an upgrade for someone. Yeah, free upgrade for Lufia. I was I was gonna ask, but I didn't want to jinx it. Like, where are all the uh, the encounters here? Um... Need food item. Let's check what remains open. Well, it's uh, Tuesday night, and there is a big storm tomorrow, so your guess is as good as mine. Yeah, we're, we're gonna get some snow, but uh, a lot of it's gonna be rain, but there definitely is going to be a lot of wind as well. Uh, 
Uh, actually, let's see. Droplet. And, uh, spot. And become one with the great winds. Okay, maybe Spark wasn't the answer. Maybe I should have just had Jaren attack normally. Just press the button to go into the the subscreens. And that's when I get that encounter. I don't know why I always like take a couple of steps before I didn't want to do that. I don't know why I always take a couple of steps before actually going into a menu. It's like, oh, I got this item. I'm going to take a couple of steps and subject myself to possibly getting into another fight before I actually look at what the site it is. Oh, it looks like my mistake paid off there. Like mail doesn't cover the legs. Okay, now it's the same armor that uh, Agur already has. Which means it's the really heavy stuff, but like, I don't know, if I'm getting it for free... Danger is my middle name, baby. to some quick boosts. Have I mentioned I still have no idea what I'm doing? Glass cap. I think that's uh, actually not an upgrade. It is not. Yeah, usually the mimics come when you open a chest and it's not a chest. They don't just show up out of nowhere. Oh, that is less than ideal damage. What is this? A critical hit is eight. D 
drop on? Drop on what? Agro is not in great shape right now. Oh, that is, uh. Hey, uh, yeah, that one runs away. Okay, we killed one of them. It's enough to level up Lufia and have her learn Bolt. Which leads us up to today's sponsor. Nobody, this stream is not sponsored. As long as I have anything to say about it, it will not be. Yeah, 3,000 experience. I mean, that's not a bad deal, honestly. I think that Iron Helm is going to be an upgrade for you. Uh, what else did I just get? Can shoes. give that to my character. Yes, if I if I had realized Jewel that the uh the the name that I input at the start was going to be the name used for the hero, then I would have probably put in something else. I, I kind of didn't think of the fact that um, that's how it worked in uh, in these video game days. Oh, jeez, no. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No! Alright then, I guess we're fighting this. <sighs> we're still fighting it, we're still... Oh, you get to run away? Fuck you! Flame Purge, uh, welcome to Let's Play the World Live. Uh, this is it's a pretty good game. It um, I'm kind of having a hard time remembering the story. Maybe it's just like the fact that my old brain is uh, has been kind of spoiled with um, how storytelling is able to happen uh, nowadays. But um, the gameplay is pretty snappy, and I, I gotta commend it for that. Could use maybe a little better um, sorting. The plot's kind of meandering, and that's basically what I'm doing right now, is a lot of meandering. Might not be able to get to Agro fast enough, though. Yeah, I didn't think so. And I level up and learn on stone. Jared levels up. And revive it is. But yes, this specifically is the um, Lufia restored. Uh, hack for the game, which is just a bunch of quality of life things that were added to the game. Um, yeah, 
it might be time to start using items here, because, like... Yeah, it, it does seem like, uh, like the Lufia Restored hack is, um, pretty well known. But a, a few people, um mentioned their appreciation for it. Hydration achieved. At this point, I'm just kind of wandering around and wondering what the hell it is I'm supposed to be doing. But I'm pretty sure that I've found pretty much everything that I currently have access to from this end of the dungeon. So I might, I might just want to, like, leave. <laughs> to item equipment spells enemies to fixing a few really bad dialogue errors and finally rain poncho help you finish it properly oh you worked on this oh well i appreciate your efforts i did not realize you worked on this i um hi <laughs> I'm Coolio, also known as Captain Oblivious, and Jaren's nearly dead. I didn't mean to do strong there, but uh, maybe it will help me not die. Or maybe we can just finish this fight. I'm going to escape. Um, who has escaped? You have escaped. We're going to escape. And who has war? You also have war. Let's work to. Nice. Things were getting a little rough in there. Dimension positive impact that oh, okay, Impala's encounter rate mod had, yeah. Um, I mean, I, I played a little bit with the monster ring on by accident, and I feel like with the monster ring was about what the encounter rate was without that patch. Oops. Remember the path. Oh, there's a kingdom right here. That's uh this is Odell. This might this might have been where I needed to go in the first place. But I am a derp, you see.
a load of jank is um, a fair qualifier for this. Also, that was an exit. I didn't want to leave yet. Wait, what, wait, what do you mean nice to see you again? This is... Do you, like, do you follow me and sell me things in different... like, what? I am confused. Um, anyway, this kite shield is not great for both of you. Should I have pulled it silk? Both of you should have half meal. Both of you have the around the wrist. Yep. Okay. Um, wrong option. stored item descriptions. So was the item description feature not in vanilla? I like I don't remember. It's been like an age and a half since I played it. Because this is pretty neat, honestly. Alright, look mode. In the Japanese original, they removed it due to space concerns. Yeah, that, uh, that seems like something that would happen. Okay, so this is still an upgrade for you. You already have a battle wire. I could get you a battle axe. Other than the fact that I don't have any money right now. Let's see. Oops. Let's see how much we can uh, raise here. Oh, I didn't want to sell that actually. Whoops. Money to buy myself a battle axe. And equip it on my person. It's pulled most of them from Lufius 2 and 3. But yeah, that that is that is a super neat. Um, feature, honestly. Like, especially, like, with the weird names that some of the magic has. Like, um... I mean, strong is not super obvious unless you, you know, have done it a few times. Bravery is not super obvious. Adoret is absolutely like this is a made up word. That word is not in the Quran. But then you look at it, travel to Ilfreya. Okay, that clears that up. The intro of the game when you had all of the spells was the most confusing. Yeah, exactly. And I don't think I realized that I could press X to actually like read the. Um, the item descriptions and stuff like that at that time. Uh, how am I on stats? I actually don't need to stay at anything right now. Oh, I I misread that uh, village name for a second. I am not going to say what I read it as. I mean, you're not wrong, Zero. You press X to doubt what this item does and figure out what it actually does.
You can't go now. The bridge of these towers is broken. What is this true? That's terrible. I remember there is an architect named Pyron at the castle. You should be able to do something. And this is what's the time. Is, uh, we used to enter a big cavern again. I'm just gonna steal this X magic in front of your face. What do you think about that? It's a good thing that this game doesn't have like um morality points or something. Like if you take all the items from everyone's houses, you end up getting like a bad ending or something. Some weird research going downstairs at a castle? Oh boy. You know I'm all for that, based on previous games that I've played for this channel. Caverns are large. I'm pretty sure I've been to one of those caverns already. Magic descriptions were in the English localization. They were only, they only were item descriptions. Gotcha. Don't worry about me. I'm just uh, robbing your crap. What are these strange machines? Computer? I've never heard of such a thing. Um, four directions. Paris Gate is north. Child Lab 1 is west. Lands are south. East returns are here. So we've been through this cave before. And this is probably Shia Lab 1, right? I'm in your locker stealing your drugs! It's locked. Who'd have guessed? Well, these lockers are not locked though. Which is a bit unfortunate considering that, you know, they are lockers. They should be locked. They are not. And I'm just gonna steal all your crap. I have heard about the Isle of Forfeit. Visit it if you have a ship. I do find the concept of the Isle of Forfeit rather interesting, just like if you end up selling an item that you didn't want to sell, then hey go to the Isle of Forfeit, get it back. Of course, you need to actually be able to get there. Oh crap, we're fighting Wispy Woods. In fact, we're fighting two of them. This is not the time for a nap. This is a fight. What are you doing?
a bit silly that, like, you have to go back into town in order to, uh... There's nothing here? Okay, then. That's weird. Okay, so we're back here. a good spell. I feel like Agro's experience curve is like a lot steeper than everyone else's. Like, you got me at level 22, Luffy at level 21, Jaren at level 20, 21, despite the fact that, you know, she started, like, three or so levels behind me. And Agro is stuck at level 19 like a scrub. Always a good thing. But I think this is the other end of uh, this cave that we were just at. and Luffy needs some help. Have a chest over here. There's another dragon egg. I hope I'm doing all right on dragon eggs. I think I have like three of them. Four of them. I don't know if that's how many I should have. Okay, we have unlocked the plot point that the bridge is broken. We have seen it with our own eyes. Now I'm guessing we go back to the castle and we should be able to hire someone to fix it, right? Or at least that's the concept. Let's go check this side. Hire the architect. Well, architect us a bridge that won't break. Just going right back down to uh yeah. Let's 
Let's check out these side rooms and see what we can pilfer from the 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 nobles here. And a couple of sources. So life source goes to whoever has the least health, which is still Lufia. She is catching up though. And spell source goes to the least magic. Parent helped me build this castle. A hot parent helped me when we built this castle. A promising young man. Bridge to Eris is broken. It's old, that's why. I can repair the bridge, but not alone. I need my own tools and my old crew. One of my old gang is enlightened. I wonder if you could call him for me. I mean, I guess we can just, uh, warp there. Lighten is southeast of here. You'll probably find a meeting at the restaurant. Actually, have we been to Lighten? We may not have. Here. Nah, no, it's just okay. So we are to have a staircase that goes directly into the throne room, but uh, I guess if Pyron designed it that way. I don't think we've been to Leiden yet. Let's go to Leiden, southeast of here. Past the armor lords, you see. The Lord of the Armor. Or is it below? That is a good question. We shall find out the answer very soon. Well, those high arrows aren't doing as much damage as they used to. I mean, they definitely, uh, definitely caused some pain to Lufia, but, um, and somewhat to Jaren also. Oh, I'll use on stone. There it is. This has got to be a light in the town of Cooks. Studying new recipes every day. What? Pirate's calling me. Seems he needs your help to fix the bridge at the Arrow's Cave. Pirate and my Pirate and I built Odell Castle. If he's calling me, I have to. I haven't had my dessert yet, but I'm going to Odell right now. Here you are, your des. What happened to the customer who was here? Something came up. He had to leave for Odell. My customers leave before they finish? Oh, I need to study more. I mean, you can give the dessert to us. I probably wouldn't mind. If it's big enough, we can probably split it four ways. It's weird that this is a thing. 
I'm guessing that none of these items are particularly useful, but like, maybe there is an easter egg where if you equip all of them, then you get like special items or something. I don't know. You go have fun? Not having fun here? I kid, Jewel. Uh, thanks for dropping by. The charred newt. Wizard of Taste. Sure. Let's see. My, this is good. I give it a seven. That's alright. Let's have a five. I like it a little sweeter. It beats a four. No touch it, too. People are tough. Purple newt that lives deep under the ground. Now I'm gonna steal all of them. These are not ingredients. You lied to me, sir. I wonder if this is a side quest of some sort. That's about all there is here. Yeah. Let's go back to uh, Odell Lake. I'm gonna check out this uh, little secret vista here. Actually, I'm not playing a Xenoblade game. That's not a secret vista. What am I talking about? I do enjoy me a good Xenoblade game. Uh. Alright, let's go and see Pirate again. We've already checked the bridge's condition. But I have to go check it again? Why? I guess I... I don't know. Uh, that seems like less than ideal design. So let's let's take the underground path here. this bridge, and then we take that bridge over there after dealing with these trees. And spreading the damage nice and even so that Jaren can clean up. Expertly performed. Now, 
Let's just deal with these, uh, these snacky snacks. Focus on those, and then we can deal with the armor lord. Arrow. I'm pretty sure that I've been stung with. Oh boy. Um, Mufi also leveled up there. Yep, the bridge is still broken. How exciting. running start. I know, my characters can't even seem to jump. Never mind trying to, uh, to leap. So hey, Pyre! The bridge is still broken. So it's falling apart. That's a problem. Well, let's take a look at it. We might, we might need your help, too. Come to the cave later. Here we go, princess. I asked you, Prime. I asked you. That was a weird exchange that happened just now. Um. Get, get out of our way. Official business. And drive through. What would you end up uh, selecting for food? You might have said so in chat before, but I wasn't. Uh, I didn't catch it if you did, sorry. Ah, McDonald's. Personally, I prefer to eat food. Let's try let's try not to, to bring that particular franchise into this conversation. I like how one of the crazy jars attacks is green. The best thing that you can do to your enemies is shoot them. A smile. Which will confuse the crap out of them.
Oh boy. This, uh, this ain't a great fight, and using magic is not helping. Actually, I should probably have had Lufia attack Agura, so that that doesn't happen. I don't think I've played any of the 2D Fantasy Star games now. I don't think I have. Uh, again, it has been a long time if I have, so... Well, the one Fantasy Star game that I know that I've played was Fantasy Star Portable. I played PSP on the PSP. I seem to remember the game not being too bad generally, but I also never finished it because the computer control players are absolute dimwits. Like, they will not start attacking an enemy until they are, like, within a meter of that enemy. Hello, would you look at this cliff? Uh, uh, would you look at this from the cliff on the right? Cliff on the right, where the treasure boxes are? Yes, you can see best from there. I can't gauge the work from down here. The job won't be easy. I need a sharp set of eyes to watch for, for mistakes. Like a challenge, no problem. Bread should be fine. So I guess we have to go like up here, which will require us going all the way to the other side of the dungeon from the outside. I tend to avoid using the term AI unless unless it's actually learning. Especially given the direction that, you know, big technology wants to take AI. Yeah, like that. That's the big problem with uh, with with uh, fantasy star portables. Like, they won't start attacking unless they're like right directly in the enemy's face. Even if they receive an attack from the enemy at range, they're like, nope. Uh, it's not my problem. Not unless. Uh, not unless that guy comes over here. Oh. <laughs> okay then. Well, that is gonna be two wasted attacks because uh Agro was also told to attack that chest. Jar. Also, there's a chest there that I never got. I think I get it from the other side, though.
Yeah, for for as bad as like flashing lights were in this era, this game isn't too terrible about it. There are some flashing lights. But I've seen much worse. Uh, Jaren learns Fireball. Fireball? Oh dear. Oh no. Make sure to keep everyone topped up for this. Especially Agro, he seems to take the most amount of uh, magic damage. And everyone runs away. Da 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 gain nothing! Okay, I need to stop spending stronger on the same character who is at full health and it is actually casting the spell anyway. That's not ideal design. I did not want to use that on Jared. Yeah, it, it would be funny if Luffy had used Bang and Jaren used Bang. They used their bangs against each other and everything just kind of blew up. I'd call that maybe, a, I don't know, comedy Bang Bang. That name hasn't been taken for anything, has it? Everything until everyone explodes. I have no idea how to get to those chests, by the way. I don't know if that was obvious, but oh, there we go. Pyron, uh, Pyron, we're ready. Right, let's start the repairs. Tell me what you think. We're tell me what you think when we're done. What do you think? We haven't done a job uh, like this in quite some time. Well, the bridge is fixed. We're going back to Odell. Um, not deal with this fight, and actually, I'm just gonna use uh, escape. Oh, right, I need to go back around and do the thing. Um, Oh, 
also don't discard it now. Um, oh, right, because I... What, what was it that I threw away last time? Like this, this game, I feel like it goes by so fast that uh, I, I kind of don't absorb it as much as other games. Oh right! The Star Rune! Right, 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 right. Ah, oh, man. That was, uh, that was an unfortunate incident. One would think, though, that, like, they, they would have a, um, like, something to check for that. It's like, oh, you don't have the star rune? Well, what if, uh, you go back over here and you can get the star rune again? Yeah, you mentioned that. But, like... I don't get why the randomizer lets you do that, is what I'm saying. And especially, like, if it can lead you to, you know, dead man walking. Hoping to get into there before another fight happened. Actually, you should probably heal out while you are spaying again. Seem like it would be a reason. Oh, for crap's sake. Ah, for the love of Jeff. Uh, let's get you healed up. across the bridge, having to deal with another gold mimic. What if I use... wait. What does this do? Turns member to stone, affects one member. Why did it target on me first? That's bizarre. Well, I guess we won't know if that works. At least this crazy jar cannot summon any more crazy jars, because I don't think there was anything uh, anyone else in its party. Who feel learns a vortex? Let's see what that does. 
big column of water hits the group of enemies. It's basically an upgraded version of Droplet. That looks like a way forward. I'm gonna skip that for now. I'm also just gonna use a sweet water right now. Let's see if we can explore as much of this area as possible. Escape in some higher high arrows. Oh high arrows. How do we get up there then? Well, whatever. I guess I'll just go take the stairs. Um... Let's see what's behind door number 17. Didn't realize Lufia was um, quite so low. Now let's go ahead and stronger on Lufia. His magic is running out a little bit, actually. Oof. That definitely is dreadful. Hopefully we can take down these guys pretty fast, because uh, that was a pretty big uh, defense loss. Oh good. Excellent. There we go. Three levels up. I don't think there's anything in this morass. It's locked. Lafalas. Lafalas. Just some kind of spell. Can't use magic. It's your turn, Jaren. I'll give it a try. The Phallus! La Phallus! I can't do it! Stand back! It's my turn! La Phallus! La Phallus! I'll try now. The Phallus! La Phallus! The door disappeared! Lufia, you did it! I guess magic is my strong point, Coolio. Have you changed your mind about me? Yes, yes. I can't stand this. While the road is open, let's see what's up ahead.
Ah, so that's how we get up here. People running out of HP here. It's not a great time. Um. Still a stronger. Now, Jaren getting a bit low. Well, we gotta revive if anything bad happens, but let's prevent something bad from happening right now. Potion. Gotta revive. And that's about it for this area. Oh, Luffy ain't looking so great right now. Well, we should be able to make it through this fight. ourselves a room. The one room. Only one room. So here we are at Aris. Hopefully we can find Professor Rail. I don't remember why we want to find Professor Rail, but uh, clearly the path forward is technology, and we're going to be doing that right after the break. So y'all can take a moment. Oh, I apparently didn't turn off the face there. Well, I can do that after a while. We've properly gone on break. Anyway, I'll take a moment to uh, get some to drink, go to the bathroom if you need to, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth. And in about 10 to 15 minutes, we shall um, uh, explore the town of Aris properly and see if we can find Professor Rail. So, See you in a bit. <laughs> 